The Great Belt fixed link connecting the islands of Zeeland and Funen across the Great Belt was opened in 1997. Transport in Denmark is developed and modern. The motorway network covers 1,111 km, while the railway network totals 2,667 km of operational track. The Great Belt fixed link connecting the islands of Zeeland and Funen and the new Little Belt Bridge connecting Funen and Jutland greatly improved the traffic flow across the country on both motorways and rail. The two largest airports of Copenhagen and Boulogne provide a variety of domestic and international connections, while ferries provide services to the Faroe Islands. Greenland, Iceland, Germany, Sweden, and Norway, as well as domestic routes servicing most Danish islands. Aalborg Airport in the north of Jutland in 2011, a total of approximately 28 million passengers used Danish airports. Copenhagen Airport is the largest airport in Scandinavia, handling approximately 29 million passengers per year. It is located at Kastrop, 8 km southeast of central Copenhagen. It is connected by train to Copenhagen Central Station and beyond as well as to Malmo and other towns in Sweden. For the west of the country, the major airport is Belund although both Aalborg and Aarhus have smaller airports with regular connections to Copenhagen. Denmark's main airports are, other airports include, being an island state with a long coastline and always close to the sea, maritime transport has always been important in Denmark. From the primitive dugouts of the Stone Age to the complex designs of the Viking ships in the Viking Age, often built to exactly facilitate large-scale cargo and passenger transportation. Denmark also engaged in the large-scale cargo freights and slave transports of the European colonization endeavors in the Middle Ages and operated several smaller colonies of its own across the globe by the means of seafaring. Today Denmark's ports handle some 48 million passengers and 109 million tons of cargo per year. Rodbyhaven Ferry Terminal on Lolland passenger traffic is made up partly of ferry crossings within Denmark, partly of international ferry crossings and partly of cruise ship passengers. Some short ferry routes are being electrified and several more may be eligible, as in Norway. Helsinger Rodbyhaven Frederikshavn Stellens Adi Esbjerg Jedzer Aarhus Rona Beltoft Copenhagen map of Denmark showing the locations. Of the major ports among the most important ports for passenger traffic are, in 2007, 288 cruise ships visited Copenhagen, rising to 376 in 2011 before returning to around 300 the following years. Around 800,000 cruise passengers and 200,000 crew visit Copenhagen each year. Among the most important ports for cargo traffic are, waterways have historically and traditionally been crucial to local transportation in Denmark proper especially the Udina River system in central Jutland, has played an important role. The waterways were navigated by wooden barges and later on steamboats. A few historical steamboats are still in operation, like the SS Jijlin from 1861 at Selgaba. There is a 160 km natural canal through the shallow Limfjorden in northern Jutland, linking the North Sea to the Kattegat. Many waterways has formerly been redirected and led through man-made canals in the 1900s, but mainly for agricultural purposes and not to facilitate transportation on any major scale. Several cities have man-made canals used for transportation and traffic purposes. Of special mention are the canals of Copenhagen and the Odens Canal, ferrying large numbers of both tourists and local citizens. Denmark has a large merchant fleet relative to its size. In 2018, the fleet surpassed 20 million GT as the government sought to repatriate Danish-owned tonnage registered abroad, with measures including removal of the registration fee. Denmark has created its own international register, called the Danish International Ship Register, open to commercial vessels only. Dish ships do not have to meet Danish manning regulations. Copenhagen Central Station with S trains. Denmark Railway Network The largest railway operator in Denmark is Denske Statsbaner, Danish State Railways. Arriva operates some routes in Jutland, and several other smaller operators provide local services. The total length of operational track is 3,476 km standard gauge, with 1,756 km electrified. The railway system is connected to Sweden by bridge in Copenhagen and ferry in Helsingør and Frederikshavn, by land to Germany and Podbor and ferry in Rodby and to Norway by ferry in Herxels. The road network in 2017 totaled 74,558 kilometers of paved road. Motorways are toll-free except for the Great Belt Bridge joining Zealand and Funen and the Orisund Bridge linking Copenhagen to Malmo in Sweden. Bicycling in Denmark is a common and popular utilitarian and recreational activity. 
bicycling infrastructure is a dominant feature of both city and countryside infrastructure, with bicycle paths and bicycle ways in many places and an extensive network of bicycle routes, extending more than 12,000 kilometers nationwide. In comparison, Denmark's coastline is 7,314 kilometers. As a unique feature, Denmark has a VIN system for bicycles which is mandatory by law. Often bicycling and bicycle culture in Denmark is compared to the Netherlands as a bicycle nation. Figures in 2015. Thanks for watching.